other than what we see on court, this this guy is is a global superstar. I, I talk to tennis players like Maria Sakkari and Stefano Tsitsipas, top ten tennis players who look up to Giannis and say that his story inspires them. What makes him so special outside the stuff we see on court? I think he's so humble, and 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 he's one of the few celebrities, and that you see that he is exactly who he is when he sits there and does his dad jokes <laughs> in the post game. Um, when you, you see the fire in him on the court, I mean, he's both uh, part kid and and part superstar, and and he embraces both of those roles and and he will never ever forget i don't know if you guys have been able to, to check out rise which is his movie yes. that came out this summer and tell a story about his family uh you know family is so important to him number one but number two never forgetting about where he came from is equally as important and so because of that he will always be uh, the, one of the most humble superstars you will ever meet. And and one of those guys that will never, ever not show the joy of playing in an NBA basketball game or whatever, whatever game he's going to be playing in. You know, I mean, I think the NBA gets a bad rap sometimes for, for players mailing it in and not caring. Um, well, I would encourage you to continue to watch Giannis Antetokounmpo and the Milwaukee Bucks because you just will not get that kind of attitude from Giannis ever. How many times did you have to say his last name over and over before, you know, the first first game call of the Bucks? You know, I got interviewed plenty of times on, on like radio stations and television stations. And uh, so I got plenty of practice with that. You know, it's interesting because um, you can pronounce it two different ways. You can pronounce it the, the Nigerian way, which is has more D's and B's in it. Um, and then you can pr- you can pronounce it uh, the way I just did, Antetokounmpo, where there's more T's and P's. Um, that's more of the Greek version. And and that's actually the way that if you ask Giannis to say his name, and I just was looking at a you know a social media clip, that's the way that that, that he now pronounces his name. Um, you know, obviously he's he's been attached now to the Greek freak, right? Branding. Yep. Um, of everything, and he's going to play for the Greek national team with his brothers here coming up in uh, the Eurobasket tournament. So, uh, but it is interesting, you know, he's got that both that Nigerian uh, descent and and now and the Greek ties as well. So, uh, just say it really fast and with authority is what I tell people. <laughs> and <laughs> at Tetecumpo, and uh, and they won't question you, <laughs> or or just call him the Greek freak. Just call him. Yeah, I remember when he first came out. Or just call him you yeah, know, on Sports Center, I would I would literally just, just say Giannis. Giannis. I'd be like Giannis, you know, I'd say a real big, you know, make it a big entrance. 